What is up, bro? It's me, Josh here, and today's video is going to be a pretty quick one over the recent event that Wargaming is holding right now, and it's actually a pretty cool one that you can just be in by playing. So all you have to do, and it's just this weekend, it starts today, the 23rd, and goes to the 25th, which is Sunday, so you got a couple days to play, so if you're playing over the weekend, you're going to basically be in to the drawing, but it is the flag Orama signal event. So if you've ever played World of Warships, you run flags, hopefully everybody's running flags on their accounts, and you can be in to the drawing of getting a free Roma and as well as free camo so that's pretty cool and they're going to be giving away a ton of these so in total it'll be 3,000 winners that's 50 romo so you can get a roma which is the tier 8 italian battleship with a 10 point captain and then they're giving away 3,000 other uh 10 type 6 camo so that's pretty cool um but seriously all you have to do is just be playing the game go into your account and uh enable flags so basically what it is Play any battle with ships of tier 5 and higher. So if you're working on any of the current missions right now, there's a lot of missions in World of Warships with the new French captain and stuff like that. The new campaign, or not new campaign, but the new collection and um, all those new missions for the French battleships and stuff like that. So if you're playing those, throw some flags on there. Every 15 flags spent, you will earn one chance at receiving a prize. And then for every 15, you get a higher and higher chance. So of course, the more you play, the more chances you have to win. And the more flags you use, the higher chance you win. So prizes are limited to one per account, so it doesn't look like you're going to be able to win four Romas. Or the, I assume if you already have the Roma, you'll probably get the, the balloons worth. Um, and then with the camels, you can win one set of that camel. So you can probably win one of each, that'd be my guess. But you're not going to be winning like you know four Roma equivalents or whatever. So... Um, and then total 3,050 will be done. So this is overall pretty simple. All you have to do is go into your port, click on exterior, and put on as many signal flags as possible. So these flags aren't going to be counting. It's actual the signal flags that they're talking about. So use as many as you can. I always recommend using detonation flags on your tier 10s. And, you know, if you're using them for clan battles and rank battles, whenever it's eventually coming up, I like to save them for that. And I, I roll only detonation flags on my tier 10s and when I'm uh, doing that as you can see I don't have very many but you know stack up all these extra ones and you know the higher amount of flags you have uh, attached to your ship the faster you can start stacking up those 15 times so if you're running eight flags per two games and you have a chance to win a free Roma so that's pretty cool and always be sure it's gonna be a, a default to disable uh, click on to enable and get through it so um so they're on every time so you're not playing games with no flags that's what you want to work on so um but yeah pretty cool a little event uh, i always like when wargaming kind of does this and the best part about this event is that you are basically into the event and you're in for the drawing by just playing the game so a lot of people that are new, a lot of new Steam players, um, again, all you have to do is be into your port. A lot of people might not know that they have flags or how, you know, they're not staying on. Go on to exterior. It's going to default to none. Start clicking on to some, some of these little ones, like, you know, the Des Moines, which is a tier 10, is a high AA ship. So clicking on to the extra AAs, you know, clicking on to the time for uh, consumables, stuff like that. You know, detonation flags, I would save to maybe some higher tiers or the competitive modes. But, of course, click on Zulu and all these other ones to help maybe get some credits and some more experience as well as the the uh, um, the really high tier ones as well if you have some of those backed up but throw on as many flags as you can now remember some of these flags aren't going to really help you out too much like there's a torpedo one i'm not really going to have a ram in my des moines that much but there are some torpedo ones if you have a ton of them feel free to use them just to get the actual point but it's not going to help on stuff that doesn't have torpedoes of course so a pretty cool event i like events that you can just play the game and you're into it you don't need to go out of your way to do anything so that's pretty cool but again 15 flags gets you a chance so if you are running seven eight flags every two games you'll have a chance to get in and um potentially get a roma so good luck out there guys hope you guys this games are going well throw on those flags enable them so they stay on and good luck winning a roma or some free camels but that's it for me guys hope you guys enjoyed this video remember to like subscribe and i'll see you guys next time